When we hear the word bat, it doesn't evoke any beauty. Instead, we imagine a dark creature resembling a mouse with wings hanging in a dark place. Therefore, it may seem strange to describe a bat as beautiful. However, this description will never truly capture the beauty and delicacy of this bat, as it's truly exquisite and remarkably graceful. In this video, we will explore the magic of the Honduran bat before I tell you about them. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell to receive updates. The Honduran white bat, Ectophila alba, also known as the Caribbean white tent-making bat, is a species of bat in the family Philostomatidae. It is the only member of the genus Ectophila. The genus and species were both scientifically described for the first time in 1892. It is a small-sized bat with an average length ranging from 3.7 to 4.7 centimeters and a wingspan ranging from 13 to 15 centimeters. It is the only bat species that is entirely white. Its ears, face, nose, and some parts of its legs and wings are bright orange. The Honduran white bat is the only known mammal species that incorporates carotenoids, a class of red, orange, and yellow pigments found in plants, into its skin. The bright yellow color of the Honduran white bat's wings, ears, and nose comes from a yellow carotenoid pigment called lutein, which is likely obtained from its diet of peeled fig fruits. The Honduran white bat only inhabits the lowland rainforests of eastern Honduras, northern Nicaragua, eastern Costa Rica, and western Panama. It is found in these lush, dense forest regions with a humid, tropical climate. The Honduran white bat is adapted to thrive in the specific habitat of lowland rainforests. These forests provide the bat with suitable conditions for roosting, feeding, and reproducing. The dense vegetation and abundant tree cover offer protection and shelter for the bats. The humid tropical climate of these regions also supports the growth of the bat's primary food source, figs. Therefore, the Honduran white bat has evolved to inhabit and rely on these specific rainforest environments for its survival. The Honduran white bat lives for an average of six to eight years in the wild. To attract females, the male follows a strategy of displaying potential roosting sites. It jumps and flies near folded or broken leaves of plants, such as heliconia, a type of flowering plant, to catch the attention of the females. If the female agrees to approach the roosting site, the male accompanies her, and they begin mating. The gestation period for females lasts about four months. Females usually give birth to a single offspring in each pregnancy. After birth, the mother embraces the young bat under her wings and takes full care of it. The mother feeds on fig fruits and continues to nurture the young bat until it grows and becomes capable of flying and self-reliance. The young bat gradually learns hunting techniques and survival skills from its mother. The Honduran white bat prefers to roost in leaf tents that they construct themselves. They cut the leaves of the heliconia plant along their veins and use their claws and teeth to create a small, enclosed space. This leaf tent serves as a safe shelter from sunlight and predatory birds. They are highly social animals living in groups of 12 to 15 individuals, roosting and foraging together. They are considered one of the least threatened species in this aspect, and their main threat is deforestation, which results in the loss of their habitats and suitable food sources. Despite its beauty and small size, it is not recommended to own this bat as a pet because it requires special care that would be difficult to provide in a household setting, leading to health problems. It is important to respect these creatures, allow them to live freely, and abide by laws that prohibit hunting or causing harm to them. We are waiting for your opinions and suggestions always. Subscribe to our channel and don't forget to activate notifications bell to receive all the latest updates.